ponds and rivers, small turtles may often be found. Turtles, like this one, are called sliders or red ears. They make good pets. They are gentle animals, interesting to watch and easy to care for. To keep a red-eared turtle as a pet, learn all you can about it. The best way to learn to care for any animal is to find out how it takes care of itself. Let's see how a red-eared turtle lives in its natural home. A red-eared turtle spends most of its time underwater, where it looks for food. It will eat almost anything it finds in the pond. Plants, small fish, tadpoles, worms, and insects. This one is trying to catch a pill bug. Sometimes, two turtles will try to eat the same food. A turtle eats underwater, but after it eats, it usually swims to the surface for fresh air and sunlight. All turtles breathe air, just as we do. A turtle needs sunlight. The sun warms its body, helping it digest its food. If you know how a turtle lives, you will be better able to care for one. To keep one as a pet, a place as much as possible like its natural home should be made for it. An aquarium or large bowl will do. A turtle needs a high place like this rock so it can leave the water when it wishes. Indoors, a small light about a foot from the turtle will warm it helping to take the place of the sun. A turtle will stay healthy if it is properly cared for. It needs plenty of clean water, as it would have in its natural home. It needs food as much as possible, like its natural food. Live food like this mealworm, is best for a turtle. If live food is not available, a good dried food, made of different kinds of insects and green plants, will do. Since a turtle will not overeat, it may be given all the food it will take. However, leftover food will spoil the water in which the turtle lives. To keep the water clean, change it every few days. After its meal, a turtle usually crawls out of the water to digest its food and to rest. Now that our turtle has a good home and has been well fed, we can look at it closely. Notice the turtle's eye. Each eye has a stripe running through it. When it takes a nap, it usually pulls itself inside its shell and closes both eyes. But with one eye closed, and one eye open. A turtle's ears cannot be seen. They are covered by skin. 
However, the red patches on the side of its head locate the ears and give it its common name, red-eared turtle. A turtle breathes through two small holes. It has no teeth. It bites off food with the hard edge of its mouth. A turtle's shell is part of its body, and a turtle can never leave it. It grows as the turtle grows. The upper and lower parts of the shell are joined on each side. The tough, hard shell protects the turtle from harm. When frightened, it can pull itself into its shell. The shell should never be painted, because paint may injure it, preventing it from growing properly, and the turtle may die. A turtle's feet are flat and paddle-like. They help it swim. The skin on its legs is covered with hard scales. The scales protect the legs, just as the shell protects the body. A turtle has a very small tail. If you keep any animal as a pet, learn all you can about it. The more you know about it, the more interesting you will find it and the more you will enjoy it. The little red ear, or slider, is a good pet, and it is easy to care for. To care for it properly, give it plenty of clean water, just as it would have in its natural home. Give it food as much as possible, like its natural food. Give it a place where it can crawl out of the water, just as it would have in its natural home. A pet should be properly cared for. The best way to find out how to properly take care of any animal is to find out how it takes care of itself.